Leicester helicopter crash pictures, latest horrific images outside King Power Stadium Leicester City owner Vikai Srivadana Prabhu's helicopter crashed outside the King Power Stadium last night. And images of the crash site has emerged this morning. Mr. Srivadana Prabhu is understood to have been in the helicopter that left the King Power Stadium pitch at around 8.30 p.m. on Saturday. Leicester had played out a 1-1 draw with West Ham in the Premier League's late kickoff. Leicester are yet to release a statement on the incident this morning but club officials have arrived for a meeting. And images of the crash site have started to emerge as the day breaks over the city. A tarpaulin sheet appears to be covering part of the helicopter. The area of the car park where the chopper landed has been cordoned off. More to follow and a helicopter belonging to Leicester City's chairman has crashed outside the King Power Stadium. The aircraft had just taken off from the pitch at the East Midlands Club and made it over the Stand en route to London before it crashed into a car park outside the stadium. Latest, horrific details emerge about tragic crash eyewitness accounts said the helicopter went into a tailspin before slamming into the concrete. It did not burst into flames immediately but was soon engulfed in a fireball. It is unknown if Leicester City's chairman Vikai Srivadana Prabhu was on board. The Thai businessman attends all of Leicester's home games and regularly leaves the ground in his helicopter. Speaking from outside the ground tonight, Sky Sportsman Rob Dorset said, it crashed into the car park just a couple of hundred yards outside the stadium before bursting into flames. The emergency service reacted very, very quickly. There were police, fire brigade and ambulances here because of the game anyway. They got to the scene very, very quickly and put the fire out after around 25 minutes. By that time I'd managed to walk around the stadium and had seen the flames and smoke myself. There were plumes of huge grey smoke pouring out of the wreckage outside the car park, outside the stadium. Now we need to stress we don't know who was on board that helicopter. It holds, I know for a fact, 20 people. I have seen it take off many times from King Power Stadium with various dignitaries and members of the board after a game to take them home. We don't know how many was on board this evening. The latest we have been told, and these are unconfirmed reports I must stress is that Angawat Srivadana Prabha, the vice chairman of Leicester City, was not on board. He was not at the game, I'm told. It's clearly a tragic situation, a very tragic accident, and one that's unfolding as we speak right now. While on Match of the Day commentator Alistair Mann told host Gary Lineker, those of you who have been to Leicester over the last few years know it's fairly commonplace for half an hour after the game. It goes up and takes him to wherever he wants to go. This was the situation again this evening. It's a common situation but within barely seconds of it taking off and going above the stand over the top of the ground, it appears to have reached some difficulties and has come down. The impression I get is beyond the car parks that are immediately around the vicinity of the stadium but fairly nearby nonetheless. It's come down, apparently there was smoke initially, then a pop and it seems to have become engulfed in flames. Look, we don't know who is on board at this stage and we don't know for sure those who got onto the helicopter, but ordinarily it takes the family. We can't confirm if the chairman was on, we can't confirm if any of his family members were on, I'm led to believe it's normally a two-person crew. I believe that was the case this evening but we really don't know for sure who was on board. That appears to be what happened. Because there was a game on tonight. The emergency services were in the vicinity so there was a very quick reaction and lots of police and ambulances and so on very quickly onto the scene to control the situation. 
It is a very serious situation but we really don't know the extent of it just at the moment. Leicestershire Fire and Rescue Service's Assistant Chief Fire Officer Andrew Brody tweeted regular updates on the situation overnight. He wrote at 9.48 p.m., important, emergency services are dealing with a significant incident at LCFC King Power Stadium. It's essential you stay away and allow 999's free movement. More info will follow. At 1.13m he delivered a second update which read, leaving at Luxpulse HQ after Mulch Agency strategic meetings following helicopter incident. Clearly serious and tragic, please don't speculate on cause or who may be involved. Think of families, friends, responders, and at LCFC and their fans. Just visited the Atlux Fire Rescue at Lux Palsa Dimasnes Trust crews still on scene of the helicopter crash at LCFC. Honestly, your police, ambulance and fire responders are magnificent, caring and dedicated. Don't ever forget it, he added just before 2 a.m.